Hi, in this video, I'm going to show you a very simple way with WP Forms to apply discount codes to payments. Now, WP Forms is a free plugin, but in order to do this, you will need to integrate Stripe in the way that we've done it um, and be able to uh, put conditional form fields in. And I'm going to show you what I mean here. So we have a payment form here built in WP Forms and it uses a drop down to select the quantity of a number of items that are going to be shipped. And as you uh, change the quantity of items, it increases and changes the amount on the form. Now, if we uh, type in a discount code, and that discount code is early discount, you'll see this pricing changes down to $28 for one. If I take that out again, it goes to, and this is fairly straightforward. We have a drop down. we actually have two drop downs, and there is some conditional logic there that says, well, depending on what is in the discount code field, change from one field to the other. So this is how we put it together. In the form itself, I've got my two drop downs. So I've got one with the full price at 35 and I've got another with the lower price at $28. And in WP forms, very simply, uh, if you want to change the price of any of those, you just change that um, in the drop down box over here. Okay, so I'll leave that one at 35. And then the second part to it is, like I said, we've got two drop downs, and as you can see, the pricing is slightly different between them. What happens here is we have some conditional logic or smart logic, which is activated, and it says um, on the full price field, hide if the discount code, so this field just above, it, uh, contains the, the text early discount or and the or is to do with whether uh, they've selected I'm in Australia or outside Australia. And because it's an or, either of those um, things will apply to that field. So the second part of that is that in the uh, discounted field, if I go to Smart Logic, it says if discount field equals that early discount code, that is what will make one show and not the other, because one is not and one equals. So if it's not the discount code, show this one and hide that one. And then if it is early discount code, show this one and hide the other one, vice versa. Um, so fairly straightforward, just takes a few little working bits to actually put together um, and then obviously make everything work. If you found this video useful, please don't forget to like and subscribe below and we'll see you in the next one.